In this Getting Started video, let's have a look at list view navigation. Now at the moment, we're looking at the FTSE 100. We can change this by clicking on other lists and then selecting an alternative, such as the AIM 100. We can change the two list buttons here by clicking on other lists and then clicking and dragging from an alternative. As we can see here, some of our columns are hidden, but we can reveal these by clicking and dragging on the column headers. Alternatively, we could always, of course, maximize the list view. Now at the moment, our list is sorted alphabetically, but let's have a go at sorting this by market cap. First off, we need to add this in, so let's click on Add Column, and then on the General tab, click on Market Cap, and then on OK. Now to sort in this column, we can simply double click on the column header. We can double tap again to sort from the smallest to the largest. Alternatively, we can click on the column header and then click on sort. You'll notice that whilst the column is selected, a red dot will appear. We can click and drag on this to resize the column. We now can't see the full title of this column. So let's abbreviate this by clicking on rename in the toolbar, choosing a new name, and then clicking on OK. We can move the position of this column by clicking on the left and right move arrows in the toolbar. And next up, we can delete a column if we no longer need it by clicking on the delete button here. Now let's select a different column and have a look at column options. Here we can change the alignment of the text in the column. We can also make this bold if we'd like to make it stand out even more. And to make it really stand out, let's click Options again, Background Colour, choose a colour, and then click OK. Something else that's available under Column Options is Column Statistics. In this particular example, we can see the average change from the previous close. We can also see a weighted average, the min and max values, and some other useful information. If we head back into Options one last time, we can see Column Statistics by Sector. Here we can see an average and a weighted average for each of the sectors represented in the list. Become a better investor with SharePad and discover the advantage.